Hi guys, welcome back to another video. So in today's video, we are going to be pulling out our South Pole bulls. So we are gonna go all the way up to the west side of our property, get the whole cow herd, bring them down to the corral, and then <laughs> Ryan just killed the pickup on film. Embarrassing. Um, yeah, but it'll be a heck of a trip, and so I thought I'd bring you guys along. Kelsey. My husband's name is Ryan. We have two small kids with a third on the way. Um, we run a cow calf operation in Hair Sheep in South Central Kansas. So like I said, today we are going to be pulling the bulls, but I thought I'd take you guys along. I have a new GoPro, which I'm super excited about. So I'm going to be giving you guys a fun little perspective um, that I don't normally give because if you've worked cows before, sometimes you just need your hands free. So if you have cows, you know it's a little bit easier to do a big move. Um, in the winter because obviously there's no green grass around. So Ryan has a little bit of an alfalfa bale on the back of the pickup and then he's gonna be leading them with cubes. Right now they're being total stink butts and just in front of the pickup not letting him go. Eventually he'll break through and kind of lead them but they get squirrely because they, they want that alfalfa treat. So my goal is to stay in the back, obviously, and I'm just gonna walk up behind them. So we're pulling our three bulls, and then we also have a mama that's not doing very well, just not looking 100%, and her calf is right here. I don't know, this red one. And we're gonna go ahead and pull both of them, keep them up with the heifers that we have at the house, just because this calf is not I don't know, we need to keep an eye on her. So, let's head to the house. Like I said, we're grazing them on this west side of the property, but Ryan's parents' house is down there. You can see their shed. And then our house is to the east of that. So we got a long ways to go, but like I also said, it's not like they're stopping to graze green grass. They're following the pickup because they want a treat. So that makes it nice and easy for us. So last year when we pulled the bulls, we had our um, little horse trailer, and I'll leave a link to it right up here in the iCards, but um, Ryan literally just set up the trailer with a couple of panels, and our bulls knew exactly what to do with the, that South Pole breed. Goodness, they are so calm, and um, I mean, Heli Star bulls are, and uh, it's been nice to see that those genetics go throughout the herd. But um, yeah, they hopped right in the trailer. Ryan closed it, um, really nice and easy. But our trailer is busy, <laughs> loaded with some stuff right now. So we can't use that. So that's why we have to take everybody down today. The question of this video, leave it in the comments below. But I know quite a few of you are gonna be South Pole people. So what does your South Pole operation, cow calf operation look like? How are you guys using the South Pole genetics? in your herd, are you liking it? Um, are you liking what you're taking to the sale barn or selling? Uh, we're interested to know. We have everybody go underneath that fence. And like I said, it's a straight shot. And they all know this, where we're going. Is that cow and calf? Yep, yep. That's a, that's a catch. Okay. Bye, 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 bye. She's coming, she's coming. Look, 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 look. Go ahead and catch. 
Go ahead and catch. Catch it. Now, let's close this. Open this and let these out. Yep. Hold on, guys. Okay, so we got the mama and baby that we need. Let's go. Let's go, guys. Now we just have the three bulls left. Western part of this field, and we can split it or do something. We can just let out a whole cow. Oh yeah, yeah, that's true. Good to buy things. But we gotta let them out by the chief shed, right? Well, no, I actually got to set up. What's thought about this gate? Okay, and there's a fence there. Yeah. Okay. Look at that. We're like professionals now. We got the cow and the calf in the first try. First five minutes. <laughs> Okay. You just want to take everybody out back there? You want to take everybody back there? Okay. Go ahead and open the red. Okay. Come on, guys. I just want these calves off. They're not gonna do it. Okay. We'll we'll take y'all. Okay. So we're gonna do catch them by. wondering yes this is how I get my pregnancy exercise <laughs> so walking behind the cows when I need to and then unrolling bales that's my pregnancy exercises in the winter seems to be working so when when will you put the boys back in honey oh. June July June July yeah. So if you haven't seen our video about going to get this guy, I'll leave it here on the screen. But be sure you go watch it because it was quite an adventure for Ryan going all the way from Kansas, driving to Alabama and bidding on that bull and getting him. If you want to see more um, cow content, this is the man that you need to um, leave comments to. Say, Ryan, we want to see more about the cow-calf operation. We have questions. So I have questions too. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. Okay, we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.